Hello, it's Cameron here from HowToBeExtraordinary.com. Uh, I just want to show you guys a little uh, trick that I use to uh, organize my Google Reader. Uh, if you're not familiar with Google Reader, it's uh, it's a way to organize and keep track of all of your uh, RSS feeds that you subscribe to. Um, RSS stands for uh, really simple syndication. So if you want to uh, get all of the, the new material from a website, you can subscribe by RSS and uh, Google Reader will pull all, all the new information and stick it uh, in one place so you don't have to go to a whole bunch of websites to find the new information. So it's really useful. If you don't use RSS, highly, highly uh, suggest that you do. Uh, so what we're going to talk about real quick is just how to organize your uh, your feeds into folders. So a lot of people uh, probably don't know about this, but you can uh, make categories uh, and and, uh, and and put all of your feeds into uh, defined categories in these folders. So if you look at the way I have mine set up, I have a whole bunch of different folders and uh, with a whole bunch of different uh, feeds in each one. So I have like for example business and I have a bunch of blogs that are uh, about business primarily. Um, I have stuff about Seattle because I live in Seattle. So I, I, I keep updated on blogs and stuff uh, in the Seattle area. I keep them organized that way. Um, at the bottom here you can see that I have a couple of feeds that are not organized. So what I'm going to show you uh, how to do is to uh, is how to set up a new folder. So uh, if I want to take uh, uh, well, the best way to do it is to take a feed that is not organized already. Um, you can click this little tab over here. So when you uh, hover over a feed, you click this little arrow button, and if you scroll down here at the very bottom, um, it's going to say new folder. So this is like really not, it's really not that easy to find. Um, but if you have other folders, uh, it'll have all the other folders above that. So if you click on new folder, this uh, button will pop up and you can name it whatever you want. So new folder. And that new folder is just going to be there at the bottom with the feed that you just put in here. Now, all of your folders are going to be uh, alphabetically organized, um, but the new one won't. It'll just go at the bottom here. Uh, but if you refresh, refreshing, well, it should have came up. It, it, it should have reorganized that. Let me try that again, actually. That is really weird. Anyway, you can just put this folder anywhere you want. So you can click here, drag it, and if you want it, you know, it should be right here basically. And it will have that feed in there. And what you can do is you can take more feeds and throw them in there. So you just grab it, drag it, and plop it in the folder. It's really as simple as that. Um, if you want to take uh, a feed out of a folder, you can drag it right back and drag it to the bottom. Or you can hover over, click the button here, and uh, you basically un you click the folder that's on and it'll un undo it for you. And um, to delete the folder, pretty much the same thing. Uh, you can go down here. Now it calls it a tag because uh, there's, there's nothing in it. So you can go here and you can delete that real quick. Yeah, and that's how you make folders in, uh, in, in Google Reader. Um, like I said, super useful to organize your feeds uh, and, and it just makes it a lot more manageable. Um, so and one little thing real quick, you can see how many feeds I'm subscribed to here once I open up each one. I mean, there's, there's just so many and without the folders, they become really uh, unmanageable. So. This just shows you, uh, you know, what you can do with a little bit of organization and makes just your life so much more manageable.
Look at, look at this. Look how long this is. You can never really find what you want if you had everything sort it just just out there in the open. So try that little trick and uh, let me know if this was useful for you guys and if uh, that, that helped you out. So yeah, this is Cameron from HowToBeExtraordinary.com. Thank you very much for watching.